Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be showing you my morning routine and I usually wake up at around 7ish and by this point my partner has already showered and is meditating and I stay up late so I am a little bit behind but I brush my teeth, I smile and I make some tea. I love lemon ginger tea. I crave this every single morning, just something warm and soothing. Before I even drink cold water, I feel like I just want to drink something warm and easy for my tummy to handle and I drop right into my practice. Sometimes I'm half asleep but I just walk on over to my mat and I start off with some mukha bastrika which is just good for clearing my lungs and dropping me into some deep breathing and then I'll do some nali which is good to do on an empty stomach and just goes along with my mukha bastrika. But I will do separate videos on all the practices that I show you today. I then drop into my moon practice which is about 45 minutes and I do this every single day without fail. It just really helps me stay stable man and digest everything that goes on in this chaotic life. And I will say this video was filmed over the course of three different mornings so don't mind the outfit changes. And I learned that every posture in yoga should lead up to a deeper experience of meditation. So the physiology behind that is very calming, is very grounding. Ready to focus on my breath. And so I do some pranayama. Today I did Nadi Shodhana. And then I always drop into a meditation after that. Sometimes it's visual, sometimes it's just a silent vipassana meditation. I'm so honored to know the things that I know and I just bow down to this great lineage and practice. And then after that, I'll do about 10 to 15 minutes of my yoni egg practice, which just involves a little ovary massage, some cyclical breathing and some squeezing and releasing of the yoni egg. and. It's a fun practice. It definitely has been a good addition. And after we're both done with our meditation, my partner and I, that is when we play the tunes. Make a morning smoothie of kale and spinach and one banana and the superfood blend, some chia seeds, some flax seeds. I love all these textures and I just add about five tablespoons of water and blend that up. It's so simple, it tastes so yummy and it's not a lot of sugar. I used to eat so much sugar in the morning back in the day and it did not make my digestion feel good. But yeah, after that I will read a book. I've been reading the Bhagavad Gita, as you guys know, but I'm also alternating with this book on authentic success from this life coach that I met in Bali who was super rad and just a really dope guy. So I love his writing. And then I start dancing like a maniac. After I'm all sweaty, I like to put my hair up because I don't wash it every morning and take a nice cold shower. I love putting oil on my body. This is Jason Vitamin E oil and this is so good for scars that I have and also just to keep my tattoos looking all fresh and I put this all over my body and then I follow it up with the creamier lotion version of this all over mi cuerpo. And today's video is actually sponsored by Thrive Market. They're one of my favorite online shops that sells healthy and organic products for 25 to 50% cheaper than normal stores because they cut out the middleman and you basically get wholesale prices delivered right to your door and I think it's really, really rad. They have these awesome filters which make it easy to shop cruelty-free, vegan, ethically, and I have never had a shopping experience like that where you can so easily find fair trade products and everything like that, so they have tons of skincare and food and cleaning supplies they literally have everything and for everyone who buys a membership they give one to a low-income family in need and today they're actually hooking you guys up with $60 worth of free groceries so click the link in my bio to find out more about that but pretty much all of my skincare 
routine consists of Thrive products because they are so affordable and I use a deep pore wash because the main cause for my acne is clogged pores. I'm using this rose face oil to help with my scarring because most of what's on my face are acne scars and so over time this combination of oils has really been helping. I mean I get like some flare-ups and then I get new scars so you know it's a process and then I use this tea tree oil kind of as a spot treatment and I just put it on any pimples that are there to shrink them and dry them out and then under my eyes I will use this eye contour gel which is pretty natural and it gets the job done so I'm really happy that I found it and I'll moisturize my lips and for my hair I get pretty dry ends so I really like to use this argon oil And that's pretty much all I do. I feel really good and I'm so grateful to Thrive for sponsoring this video so check them out in the description. But yeah, my mornings are just so happy because there's so much potential to have an amazing day. Anyways, I go to my clothing rack which is a pretty new addition to my apartment and all of my clothes actually fit on here which has made it so much easier to get dressed having minimalized a lot. And this is my outfit of the day from head to toe. It's second hand, except for the two necklaces that I'm wearing. And yeah, this is the fit. And that's pretty much all I do in the morning, so thank you guys so much for watching, sending you so much love, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!